How's up, Mary's Office, and welcome back to the channel. I'm really excited about this video today because it's a creator and a streamer tool. It's something that I've been waiting for. It makes making clips that are ready for platforms like TikTok, uh, YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels, those vertical platforms, and taking your Twitch clips and making them vertical so easy. This is, it's gonna, it should be huge. I, I, I can't believe how easy it is. And I'm going to get into the video. It's called Cross Clip. It's made by Streamlabs, a company that's very reputable, obviously. Many of you probably use Streamlabs. I'm going to show you exactly how to use it and why it's so easy. You know, right now it, it can be kind of difficult. And I know some people say it's easy, but to get into Adobe or to get into some other video editing program and teach yourself how to edit videos, make them vertical to put, you know, everybody wants that, those sweet clips with your, your face cam up top in some form and then your gameplay down below. You can do that with cross clip. So I'm going to show you how to do it. We're going to talk about cross clip as we go, explore the whole thing. It's so easy. It's blowing my mind. I already subscribed for a year. You don't have to, there's a free version of this, but I already subscribed for a year to get advanced features, which some people will or will not like, but you know, there's a paid version, but there is a free version. Let's just take a look at it. I'm very psyched about this. This is going to help my, my content on TikTok and Instagram and YouTube shorts so much. I already know. So let's get right into it, guys. So here is CrossClip itself. It's literally crossclip.com, easy as could be. You log in with your Twitch account right up here in the upper right. And then here's the basic platform. I do wanna note, I have not used it yet, but there is a version available for iPhone. So if you're an iPhone owner, you can get CrossClip and add it on the go with your mobile phone. I can't do that. I don't own an iPhone. I can't show you that here, but I can show you it's crossclip.com and we're going to go from there. Okay. So this is really easy. Once you log in with your Twitch account, I'm going to take uh, this clip from Splitgate last night. And what you do is you en enter it. It says enter Twitch clip URL right here. Just put it right in, or you can upload a file. If you have it stored and it's not like a, a clip link itself. So let's say you're a streamer on uh TV and you make your clips on OBS with a button instead, and you've recorded it. You can do the same thing as you can with the URL right here. You just gotta get that button instead of this. So you click get clip. So from here, it loaded my clip that quick. Here we are. Here's my input. Here's the clip over here. So here's the little content square. You can adjust the size, you know, zoom in, and you see it changes over here. If you want to zoom in on a, just a specific area of your screen, but I'm going to do like a normal vertical uh, thing here. Here's a really cool part. See, here's the output right here. So you can adjust this and make your whole screen uh, just the gameplay if you want to. But what I want to do is what's really popular on TikTok. And you can change the output formula right here to landscape for YouTube or square for Instagram. I'm going to do portrait for TikTok. That's what I want to make for this video. You all know how popular TikTok is. See this little camera over here, this little camera square that I'm going to put right over, right over my camera on the clip where it was on my live stream on Twitch, where I stream every Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday by 7 p.m. I also do bonus streams, usually on Mondays, sometimes on Sundays. Come check me out. We play lots of competitive games. We have a lot of fun. Talk about G Fuel Crypto. Lots of great games, discovering games, gaming news, all that stuff. Anyway, move this thing over where you want your camera to be. And here it is. Here's the output. This is what my TikTok, the output video will look like that I can upload directly to TikTok. There's my camera on top. There's my gameplay right below it. So you can see my reaction. This is what's popular on vertical platforms right now. So if you're paying, if you're paying for this, uh, like I am, I decided to because I was so uh, enthralled with it. Uh, you can turn the watermark off. There is a watermark on if you uh, are not paying for this. It's either $5 a month or $50 a year. Uh, you can put the watermark on if you want. I, if you're paying for it, I don't know why you want to do that. So turn it off. You can also put an outro. It's like a made on cross clip, like a little advertising, you know, it was made with this app. Um, if you're paying for it, don't know why you want to do that, but you don't have to pay for it. You can just put it right there. Uh, and then here you can adjust again, you can adjust the, the camera, uh, the different variants, the portrait landscape or square. And then you can also adjust the content uh, right there. There's more edited options, editor options, show input borders, show output borders. Uh, I want that it just makes the job easier seeing what 
parts of your, your video you're highlighting for this. And then you're going to hit compile over here on the right. And then here, finalize your output settings, frames per second, 30 or 60 FPS, and quality 720 or 1080. Uh, different, you know, most people probably aren't going to notice any difference at all when they're watching this on TikTok or Instagram or YouTube Shorts. Honestly, they're probably not, but you can mess with this, see what quality comes out better for you after you've uploaded it. Hit start compilation. Your clip is compiling. We'll send you an email containing a download clip link once your clip is ready. Clips typically take two to three minutes to compile. Once compiled, you can download your clip and upload it to your social media and share it with the world. Looking for easy mode? Check out our companion app below, which lets you share directly to TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, and other social media platforms. So with the iPhone app, you can share it directly because it's if you're going to have that, you know, the, natively share it directly to those platforms on the same device. So I am using the desktop version, so I cannot do that. But what I can do, let's head to my email, see if it's done yet. What I can do, um, I'm assuming at least cross clip, your clip is ready. You guys can see how it looks. Hi, Mayor Reynolds. You can download your clip or you can open it in a mobile app for easier sharing. Uh, let's see, let's go. I can't do the open in the mobile app, but you could, uh, with an iPhone, just click that link in your email. I'm going to download my clip. It comes in MP4 format. I'm just going to put it on my desktop for, for giggles. Splitgate triple. And here it is. I have the audio turned off so you guys can't hear that, but that's, what's going to be uploaded to TikTok. Is that fancy? my webcam up here, my gameplay down here, and it's super blown up on my screen right now. It's exactly what I want. I've been waiting for a program like this. This is something that streamers need. It makes video editing for vertical platforms like TikTok, Instagram Reels, and YouTube Shorts so much easier. Uh, this is an awesome tool. I love it. Again, uh, there are costs associated if you don't want the watermark or the outro. But if you do, if you don't mind those things, it's totally free. Cross clip from Streamlabs is free. If you don't want those things, it's five bucks a month or $50 a year. That is, uh, in my opinion, uh, pretty affordable. I know that you, you know, the, the cost of like Photoshop and uh, Premiere and stuff, what is it like 20 bucks a month or 30 bucks a month right now, something like that. So if you don't want all those extra features, if you don't need to edit other videos um, with those programs, <clears throat> You can get this pretty affordable for just just this one job. It does a great job. I'm excited for it. Tell me what you guys think of it in the comments. Do you think it has enough tools? Do you think it needs uh, it needs this feature or that feature? Are you willing to pay the price to use this? Give me all your thoughts, guys. But I'm really excited for it. It makes the editing process so, so easy. And I'm going to be using it a lot to make TikToks. Come follow me over there, by the way. I still need a thousand followers so I can do live streams on TikTok. So. Come follow me on TikTok, Mayor Reynolds TV. We'll see you in the next video, guys. Mayor Reynolds out. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you want more videos like this. Hit the thumbs up button or something.